Okay, now before this video starts, I just want to point out that this video is only for people with the iPhone 6s and above. So essentially people with iOS 13 and above. So the iPhone 6 and under, uh, you can click on the card that is up here. But yeah, if you have an iPhone 6 and uh, below, you can check out that video there. Hey guys, so today I'm going to be showing you guys how to get much better battery life out of your iPhone. So the iPhone that I'm going to be using is this iPhone 6s. Now, apparently, the iPhone 6s has always had okay. battery life, but this particular iPhone 6s here has 73% total capacity. So let's get into the first tip. Now, the first tip is obviously to turn on low power mode. Now you can do this by going into settings, scrolling down to battery, and then just turning on low power power mode. So, essentially what this does is that this limits the CPU power by about 40%. Now, low power mode can save up to 15% battery. Now, another hack is to disable motion and transparency and stuff like that. So, what you're going to want to do is, assuming you're on iOS 13 and up, go to settings, accessibility, go down to motion, and then check reduce motion. So, apparently, this removes the parallax effect and just replaces it with a fade effect when you close or open an app. And when you're still in accessibility, you can also click on display and text size and then check reduce transparency. Now this makes everything that was sort of like blurry and stuff totally opaque and have a solid color so it's not taking up as much GPU resources. Now another thing you can do is when you're still in settings, go to general and then go to background app refresh and then just turn it off. If you have many apps then this really really helps with everything because you don't have it just constantly checking for new updates and new notifications for those apps. Now here's another tip. Something that I found really cool was actually to turn on dark mode because this is actually saving power by making the pixels darker and if you turn on dark mode you can save 30% of battery life, which is really amazing. So to turn on dark mode, just go to display and brightness, and then, as you can see here, just change this from light to dark. This is very effective if you have an OLED screen because the pixels actually turn off instead of the backlight staying on even though the screen's already dark. Now, another thing you can do is to turn down your brightness to 50% or less. Now turning on, you're now turning your brightness to the maximum is really sucking up a lot of energy. Now, and turning your brightness down to 50% actually saves a lot of power. If you don't like setting your brightness to the absolute minimum, you can set it to 50% and not have to worry about, you know, just your battery draining. Now another thing, which is actually the, the biggest tip that you have to do to get, get really amazing battery life is go back to the main page of settings scroll down and then under battery you're going to find privacy so go to privacy and then turn location services off now what this is doing is this is essentially tracking your phone and like tracking where your phone is and stuff and uh you know you really don't need that in your day-to-day -day life when you're watching tiktok or youtube you know you just you just don't need that and also underneath location and services you have tracking now uh you need to turn you tur turn that off because you don't want apps tracking your location i've i found this feature to be completely useless throughout all the years that i've um, used an iphone so yeah and then once once you're done with these two options up here you're going to want to scroll down and go to motion and fitness and then turn fitness tracking off that's probably on by default and then go back and then click on analytics and improvements now by default this is tr these are turned on probably uh but you're gonna want to turn all of these off so you're not sharing any unnecessary iphone analytics so yeah you may notice that your battery is so much better now, even after these tips, if your battery is still not amazing, well then, what you're gonna wanna do is just go to general, and then scroll all the way down to reset, and then, and then uh, erase all content and settings. But if you don't wanna erase all content, just click on erase all settings, that works too. Now I'll leave you with one last resort. Double click the home button, 
and close everything. Now I just closed one app, but you may have like tens of hundreds of app not. You can just uh, double click on the home button and then just swipe up everything. So now uh, there's nothing running in the background. It's just you, your phone, your home screen. I really, really hope you enjoyed this video. If you loved it, please subscribe. And I'm gonna see you guys in the next video. Bye!